Hello and welcome to the XView. My name is Paul and that's Agamemnon and he's having a good old snooze out in the background. You can probably hear him snoring. And today we're going to go over Melanie C, formerly a Spice Girl if you don't know who she is, and her song Touch Me, which I believe is a remake of a remake of a remake. Let's find out, shall we? Yep, definitely a remake of remake of remake. It just seems like so far this version of the dance song is uh, a downbeat dark version of a upbeat dance stream. You have to hand it to Mel C. She's able to adapt with the uh, music of the times, I guess. Because she's the only recording member of the Spice Girls left. Victoria Beckham gave up a long, long time ago. Jerry Halliwell ends up giving up. Mel B is getting funded by Eddie Murphy. She gave up. And Emma Bunton works on the radio. So, Mel C, is the only one that's still recorded? Has she lost anything from her vocal ability? Nah, I don't think so. Lots of reverb on her voice though to go with the darkness of this song. Suppose this version you would play in the club right at the end of the night, to, you know, right towards the end, but personally I wouldn't play it in the club, it's just too dark. You want to go to the club to enjoy yourself and go bang in tune, let's get on the floor. So I don't get this, this, is, this version of the song is just an anomaly if you ask me. Don't sit down downbeat version of this song. You know it feels right. I know. I will do mine. I'm taking it to Tell me what you're feeling. I'm feeling with you. I'll take your love and I'll take my chance. I suppose you could do a very interesting light show to it, how it goes up and down. Building up to crescendo. Yeah, you could do some interesting light shows with this. You know, you add some purples and reds, a few pinks in there for effect, flashing, strobing like hell. Yeah. Don't see a purpose for this version. Sorry, Mel C fans. You know that she's got the ability, but this song doesn't show anything about what she's about. It's just a personal project, I would, I would suggest. Personal project rather than it's not about the money, but it's not about making the record, it's about doing something she wants to do, which is all well and good. But for a dance tune, it doesn't work for me. So that was Mel C with Touch Me. If you enjoyed today's video, please hit like, subscribe and share. If you haven't already done so, you can find us on Facebook, Gab, Pilot and Twitter. And I shall catch you next time. Bye for now. If you've enjoyed our content from The X Review, why not give us a like, subscribe and share. If you didn't already know, we have more content from our parent company, Master X Media, such as fiction podcasts. The first being Gumshoe, where our anti-hero and general scumbag Percival Reginald Vert, who runs the PR Vert Detective Agency, 
There's also 30 Years Since, which is a sci-fi action podcast set 30 years after an alien invasion, and we follow a group of resistance fighters. And finally, we have a tribute to men that hate their jobs, which follows a man that has to take a pandemic job that he really, really hates. All podcasts are available on Amazon Music, Apple Podcasts, Google Podcasts, Pandora AMP, Red Circle, Spotify and Stitcher. Till next time guys, bye for now.